What's good, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Fun with Dom. Dom. And we're here on this fine day in Southern California where the cars roam around mm. from the 101 to the 10 West, filled bumper to bumper. Not a land <laughs> for many drifters or racers. Mm. Vroom, but, vroom. but here today, we have a drifter and racer who resides in Los Angeles. And I'm sure it is frustrating where you may not drift mm. when it's filled with rush hour traffic. <laughs> but she is a free bird, a phoenix, if you will, of the road. Phoenix. A uh, uh, wild stallion. Wild stallion. A mechanical <laughs> transformer. A mechanical transformer. A feminine transformer, yeah. if you will. She is Sarah Choi, ladies Let's and gentlemen. One and only. Sarah. Hi, guys. Thanks for having me. Hey, thanks for coming. <laughs> uh, Sarah is a friend of ours in real life. Yeah. Um, this wasn't a forced guest. This is a <laughs> someone who... <laughs> <laughs> who we hang out with and see at functions, and she also said she likes the podcast, yeah. and we were like, well, we should have her on because she's an interesting person who does interesting things. Absolutely. And one of those things is race and drift cars. She's a drifter. What would, what would one call a person of your profession? Uh, the pro version would be like a pro race car driver. I would be a race car driver, and then there's drifter, and then there's racer. You can short it or yeah. make it long, however you want. So a drifter, um, mm -hmm. I, I like drifter, mm -hmm. but drifter is also a term for like a hitchhiker of some a sort. Nomadic right? person. Oh really? Yeah, yeah a carless oh, person is also a drifter, <laughs> yeah, for sure. which is interesting. I've been a drifter for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's stunt driver, and yeah. then there's et cetera, et cetera. I mean, drifters are usually all stunt drivers or can be so. That works too. Uh, that's true. Oh. I find it really exciting because I, I look at your IG stories and you're doing these crazy stunts, even like pranking your mom inside the car. Oh my god, you remember that? That was like years ago. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, do I remember? I have it saved in my IG story. We're <laughs> fans. We are fans. Um, yeah, but I want to ask you, when did you get into cars? Do you want the long story short? The store short short is fine. <laughs> the short is fine. Like, oh. I, like, I like the long story. No, no, well, no. Like, I'll, I'll do it obviously yeah, yeah. decently. Yeah. Um, just drift through it. So then <laughs> I'm born in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Uh, so I'm born and raised in Hawaii, and then um, I left home around 15, and then so a bunch of like I went to nine schools in Hawaii, which is mostly all the schools there. But nine. Anyways, wait, wait, wait. Nine schools in Hawaii. Yeah. <laughs> That's an island. So. Half private school, half all public. Gotcha. Oh, you just wanted yeah. to try out all the schools. No. Like Was my it disciplinary a little bit? Yeah. Okay. Four of them. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. A little troublemaker. So it ties right. into like why I do what I do, mm -hmm. but oh. I grew up. But anyways, in a more mature way. Yeah. Of course. But um, I ran into like a community of friends that all kind of like took care of me. I like left home. I was a rebel child. I, I was see. a runaway, mm. blah, blah, blah. And I was basically homeless for a year by choice Yeah. or two. Actually, since I was 15. And then um, they were all car kids. So they would do like street racing, like oh. car cruises. In Hawaii, there's nothing really much to do, but either you do drugs, go surfing, yeah. mm -hmm. have barbecues mm -hmm. at your house, smoke weed, whatever. Yeah, sounds like cars, a life. Yeah. And you just like have to have like a hobby. And so they're all into cars. I kind of joined that community. I was around it a lot and I needed a job. So my first job, they eventually linked me up with a, a tuning shop there. Yeah. And then I worked there full time, got my um, first car through my boss that I paid off. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then um, from there on, I surrounded myself with mm. that culture. And then yeah. I was well racing there and it's all like, illegal because there's no legal tracks in mm. hawaii true it's it's kind Street of yeah, it's mm -hmm. free there there's less yeah, regulation. everything's mountains everything's freeway right. we only yeah. have wow. three freeways h1 h2 h3 mm. so and then legally it was more lenient to get away with for instance like in la when i moved here there's like point systems right yeah. right yeah like you can't jaywalk here yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> jaywalking is yeah now it's, but, now it's legal actually. yeah but in hawaii you get a speeding ticket, you pay it off, you're good. Yeah, so you a little more pay it off, well, pay Only it off, the island off. can judge yeah, us. Yeah, and so oh, all yeah. my <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> So all my shit transferred over as points here and I got oh, kind of fucked. Shit. Oh shit. Wow. Yeah. Wow. But now after like five years or something and all like cleared, yeah. I believe, but um it's pretty high still. Well let me ask you, is the car community considered the people involved in the car community considered to be rebels? Are they usually troublemakers in any sort? Like it, as a youth when you were coming up? Um it so it's a huge community. It's, it's a wide. huge. It's yeah. millions of car enthusiasts. Right, right. Oh, wow. and of course, there's like 
the rebel ones and yeah. then there's the really ghetto rebel ones that does those stupid takeovers oh, right. yeah. like the middle i i we don't You're claim not part them of the takeover. no we don't claim that. that's a whole separate community the culture that i'm in do not claim them at I all see, I see. just they have cars they can pay for cars and they it's do different dumb scenes shit. yeah 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 yeah, yeah and then um and then it depends on where you are, if there's tracks, if they're not. Yeah. And then if you're like a car person, you want to like get it out. So you kind of turn to doing it illegally. Even For sure. It's yeah. a choice or not. It's it's uh, So when you got into it, you're young. Mm -hmm. It's obviously a high to be going fast. Right. What, what, it's such a high. It is. Mm. It is. What, what, what kind of drugs is the choice of the racer? Is it speed? <laughs> Just wondering. Um, it is speed, adrenaline. And then <laughs> the part that you're reveling. I guess as well with street like racing yeah. more specifically street racing and also I give more respect to people who can also fuck around like that versus the one that just do it on track too. right a difference. Oh. right, oh. right. Yeah. Of course. for instance even pro drivers like not all of them even though they're pro can do what like not like toge they're called toge drivers or toge racing but yeah what they can do like it's a different mentality that you need to have which is like big balls for so sure did you have yeah. to be like a passenger before you started doing it by yourself well like, i was too young to have a license i actually left around 14 late 14 and so i was driving illegally because i had to get around i was on my own and then um i got my car 15 when i think legally 16 right yeah and so i was doing i was at first with them in the car all the time seeing all the races and stuff mm. and then i was a little girl that like we would go into like an industrial area and then um you know like drag racing yeah, yeah. we're like i'm like this and i'm like go oh, yeah. oh wait so you were the of fast course. and furious yeah flag. but with my hands and like hawaii local version and yeah. my like slippers and Jet like palms, i was tan I mean? as fuck and i had like abg hawaii makeup oh. like it was right, like, and right. then i was just like running there with my shorts on and flip flops i'm like go. they were like they were like we are ohana <laughs> <laughs> What? I have uh, it's the Fast and Furious Island version. <laughs> I have two questions. Uh -huh. First one: What was your first car? Uh, mm. Honda Civic, aka EK Coupe. So it was okay. a '99 Coupe. My second question is: When did you fall in love with speed? Like, when did did someone take you on a ride, and then you felt that experience, that G's? Like, how how did you like fall into? Oh, that you know what passion? G's are. Come on. Oh, whoa. What, what, what is, is it? it? Come on. <laughs> what is it, G? What are we talking about here? Come on, G. Is it like the Not G the G force? spot. The G yeah, yeah, the G The G, four. The G spot yes. of cars. So basically, <laughs> when you're speeding, there's that, like, you know, in like roller coasters where you yep. have that, like, yeah. Yeah. that's a G. That little. Yeah. With that's all Gs. Is that an actual scientific yeah. unit? Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. yeah, it's like a term. G force, <laughs> right? G force. Or Gs. But then, like, the slang is Gs. Yeah, absolutely. Gs are like everything G is really cool. Like, G force. G unit, <laughs> G, G dragon, G spot. Yeah, G yeah. spot. So you were more about <laughs> getting the G force than the G spot hit. Um, ew. I, mean, I think first of all, no. The oh wait, I didn't even hear the G spot part. I just heard. Uh, I get his question. Um, I, I think because I like left home and I was like in super rebel mode and I had like a lot of um. I was going through a lot of family stuff. Yeah. So that community gave me like commu community, course, like family. Right. There's camaraderie and then there. Doing that with them also, also as being a rebel, just gave me such a like mm. a. Uh, yeah. yeah. Mm. I felt like crazy. I felt like this crazy high. I felt like it was like a distraction. It's just like a drug, basically. For sure. I gave myself like own hits of. Yeah. Dopamine it's self-medication in a way you know yeah. what i mean could i ask you something because i know you know i have a tesla mm -hmm. and like teslas they accelerate really fast but is that kind of considered corny to you because you're coming from another world of cars you know a little um, sports cars. ev is a whole different subject like i am biased where i hope i mean i'm all about global warming yeah yeah and also as my like passion like i love gas run cars right, and right. i hope the future doesn't change into all evs which it will and i understand and it should yeah for so the e-force doesn't do anything the for e you yeah, e-force does nothing for but, you but like g-force um in tesla's the launch like uh, what was it called like the ludicrous the yeah, ludicrous mode. Yeah, ludicrous yeah, yeah. mode. Yeah. I get so nauseous off that shit. Like it's crazy. That yeah, feeling yeah. is crazy. Does it feel different from like the G Force? You feel like it, you could tell. Um, it's just a really fast car. Yeah, all yeah. G Force it's, is it's same. The amount of how fast a car can go at like launch. Mm. You um, like the sound, the revving of the engine. Oh, I love that. it. Yeah. Living so fucking annoying. What do, What do you think is What do you think it is though? Why do people like that? Like I'm curious because you know when I when I'm on the, mm -hmm. when I'm on the street I hear a car passing by. It's yeah. loud as shit. Mm -hmm. 
uh, I'm sure that does something for the person doing that, causing that. Yeah, right? it gives you a hit, and then it also it's like, yeah, for sure, <laughs> done. I'm fucking un either annoying all you guys or like my car sounds good. It's, okay, it's like that. It's like yeah. you're you just you're a one ride. with your car. Yeah, so you you're feel making like it feels like sexy to you, like when you're in it and you feel like. Does it feel sexy? Sexy. I feel me, so maybe if that's the part of me, then yeah. <laughs> yeah, sexy as hell. You know, yeah. you, when you're gassy, right? You can feel sexy in a fart gassy. focus. I'm you know? just saying, when you're gassy and you have to fart, right? Don't you sometimes want to fart as loud as possible? You know what I'm talking about? Like, who does not that? Not really. When you're by I yourself? Mean. No, not in, not in public, obviously. I'm saying when you're at home. Don't you sometimes want to rev yourself, bro? And then, and then you feel like a king. You feel like a king. I think that's what it's kind of like You're when like, you yeah. rev. I mean, I don't think about. I mean, when I'm by myself, who am I showing off to with my fart? Yourself, bro. Nah, there's nothing like that. For me. <laughs> there's nothing like that for you. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the older I get, the less I can even control my farts. To be honest. <laughs> oh, are you sharting Christ. already? No, 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 I'm not sharting. <laughs> yeah. But I, 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 you know, I think I'm eating a lot of um, fiber and stuff, <laughs> so I am farting more. Um, but I, I did look up something recently. I was like, I think as you get older, your butthole gets looser. Mm. Get some I mean, Botox. Or or I'm just saying. No, <laughs> no, no, no. no. What? I'm you want to tell saying, the world that? <laughs> no, I'm just saying. The the, the <laughs> timestamp that. No, the more the more like if I have a random sneeze or an aggressive cough, no. a oh, fart no. might slip out as well. A fart might slip out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Or maybe I just give less fucks. It's like yeah, girls, yeah. Like, it's, you could accidentally pee when you like sneeze or laugh so hard. Mm. Oh, dude, does that happen with girls? But like we can do kegels. I don't know if guys can do kegels with. Butthole. That's what I'm saying, but you gotta do. <laughs> yeah, that's the same advice for. But I gave you got to him. I was like, just squeeze your butt. Yeah, but you gotta more. be conscious of that. Like, I guess you know me, my personality. Yeah. I started giving less fucks as I got older. Right. Even my buttholes, like I don't give a fuck anymore. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think they're just a little bit. I don't give a fart. <laughs> yeah. I don't give a fart. Does it happen with your number two? No, no. You know, guys. You know, like the pee bone is connected to the fart bone. Yeah. And uh, does that happen with girls bone. too? I personally haven't had that issue like with when like you a pee? peeing or anything like you that. Do you guys fart when you pee? Yeah. yeah. That happens too, that right? That happens to yeah. everybody. Okay, I was I actually never thought about the pressure. that. Pressure, you're you know, you're applying pressure. I, I see it happening. So there's What? A, Wait, you guys yeah. totally do that. Yeah, of course. No, no, I, I'm, of course. <laughs> He's I'm not like denying it. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just, it? you know, equation wise, I see it. Well, you know when you're driving mm -hmm. and you get that like that you when you first started did did you have any sort of weird bowel type of movement when i drive yeah like does it get so <laughs> you know when like you know that feeling when you're on those like uh you know, viking like ships the viking ships yeah, you start yeah. feeling like a little like oh sickness like motion sick. sickness yes yeah, so i wonder if you know with people drivers. probably do when they go for a ride with you and they're you not to, used to it right? i mean Absolutely. i think that's just it stems from just anxiety if, or mm. if you're scared or nervous of riding in it yeah yeah, yeah but you, other than that i don't like oh shit i gotta fart every time i drive <laughs> you, you can't <laughs> so let me ask you this when you're inside a, when you're weaving bobbing weaving through traffic mm -hmm. There's you can't hesitate at all. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's a big thing, right? Yeah. And, and the people who do hesitate, that's when accidents happen. Yeah. I feel like that too. With like a lot of times with traffic around the world, mm -hmm. you know, people. Th I think L.A. There's all these accidents mm -hmm. because other cities I go to, they drive crazier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's less accidents. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's because people here hesitate when they're merging onto. Nah, act. I think mm. LA I have the most fun actually driving. Really? Why? Yeah, what, what, what's the reason? Everyone doesn't give a fuck. You think so? Oh, that's <laughs> ah, so and wild, everyone's wild like really mm. fast. So the grass is always like for instance Hawaii I get so pissed. Like people mm. are actually Just, yeah. extra hesitant. Like yeah. if you want to speak he hesitant Hawaii is hesitant. Right. Yeah. Yes. Because I mean, so their pace slow. is slow. Yeah. They're hesitant. They're so nice, which yeah. is great. Like, they let everyone in. <laughs> everyone. Yeah. And they're so chill that, like, my I'm like, like I'm yeah. like, like oh, I want to go, even though I'm not in a rush yeah. to be anywhere. And LA is like, where it's at, I think. Have right. you driven yeah. in like Vietnam where like, have you seen the traffic there, the flow? Yeah, I saw that Yeah, too. do you think that that would be some place that you would be mm, able to? On a moped. But <laughs> 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 right? Like I can weed through, yeah, I mean that realistically, but um, for sure outside of the cities, like in, in Japan mm -hmm. or like Korea and like not anywhere, not city, it, you, it's really fun. So you've seen the lot. different driving styles of different cities. Oh yeah. Yeah, well uh -huh. what's the differences have you seen? Like, what's Korea like compared to some certain places? Korea, there is no car culture and there can't be right now. And it's so sad. Oh, oh why is that? So they do have a small community of 
I would say tuner culture, mm -hmm. aka I don't know if you guys know like JDM, like Japanese mm -hmm. cars. And then there's exotics, like Korea is full on exotics, but I wouldn't call them car people because they're just people who have money to buy exactly. an exotic car. Yeah. And You're then talking about like the Lamborghini. Yeah, clubs yeah, or yeah, like, like that. McLaren, I like the, the Ferrari side mm -hmm. of things. And then there is tuner and then there is like a motorsports side in Korea. So they have it at um the the, the speedways, I've uh Inje speedways and stuff like that. There's drifting, there's time attack. I don't know about karting but um in korea they're so strict first of all it's really expensive to import a car because korea is all about korean cars only so like when oh, you really? want a japanese car when i see one in korea i'm like oh shit this yeah. guy got it because he no wanted japanese this. car <laughs> korea car <laughs> only <laughs> japanese car no g g force no good korea number one g force yeah and it's <laughs> so illegal to have like so many things and another citizen can rat out a car for yeah. having a modified car and then send oh. it to police that's oh. wax so sore can, losers so can wax. like snitch yeah oh, and there's cctv gosh. everywhere and then police are really strict and like mm. there's i learned this new shop rule in korea where you can't buy used parts it from has anywhere. to be new it, every part on a car oh. has to be new oh wow i was like whoa that's crazy so it just limits a lot of things yeah well, sucks. So the yeah. ideal country would be where Japan. if you could for you uh really yeah, okay for sure 100 yeah. percent. Oh. yeah i'm thinking of probably staying there half half soon wow yeah, uh, wow well, like tokyo uh osaka oh. yeah i love osaka i think because my hawaii side of me it's like they're more like that's aggressive true. and chill Tokyo's like very mix of LA, New York. Like we just right. care about ourselves. Like blah blah. Do blah. you get the same high f from driving other type of vehicles that aren't cars, like <laughs> boats, <laughs> snowmobiles? <laughs> I'm yeah. just saying. Skiing. I love sports. Okay. So yeah. like skiing. I'm um, not golfing, but skiing. I love things speed. that yeah. speed. Yeah. Speed yeah. Base. Golfing. And, yeah. yeah. A little too slow. <laughs> yeah. I was like, Jet I was like, what's all the sports I do? But oh. I was like, yeah, I love um, skiing. I love snow season. Wow. I haven't went this season because I was, but I'm about to go. Wow. Well, let me ask you, would you, could you ever date a dude who doesn't know how to drive? <laughs> <laughs> That's a full on subject. Okay. So I just got out of a seven year relationship. <gasps> that was a guy that was, um, full on into cars. Yeah. And prior to that was five years with another car dude. <gasps> which is my half my whole life basically my whole Damn. life i mean that makes sense you're in the community yeah, yeah. into it though but um I mean, people drift apart you know <laughs> I'm, sorry. I'm, sorry. I'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry all right all right you're right <laughs> people did drift you. apart well played yeah. so yeah. that's the only types i which is two guys i've ever dated and well not including high school right yeah. but yeah. then um i recently I'm completely open to non-car yeah. guys, and I prefer it that way because now as I'm older, I think too much of something is not good. That's true. And I don't want to get too jaded in my, you know, industry because it is getting there sometimes. Yeah. And um, Could you I actually like when guys, if they don't know about cars, mm. they say they don't know and try oh, to cover because yeah. right. that's the biggest ick for me. Right. When every time I meet someone new or like someone's trying to like, you know, holler or whatever. You said, and then you said they pretending? Over, they overcompensate. Yeah, they, they try, try to, to like talk about like, or like in like, various they act ways. Like they Whoa, right. sick G force, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, shit like that. Shit like that. That's some shit I yeah. would do. <laughs> shit like that. Like weird lingo oh, that I can shit. tell they don't know anything, yeah. but they're trying to know. And I'm like, please stop. It's okay if you don't know. <laughs> I know this is an EV. My real car's in the shop right now. <laughs> God, I hate these. <laughs> and it's an automatic too. <laughs> Fuck Elon, am I right? <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, no, is it safe to real. like say that these guys that you've dated, I, I guess in my head, I'm uh -huh. like, if someone is into like fast cars, they're, they don't play it safe. Like I assume that they love adrenaline and they do things that are like not your typical like safe route mm. so could you date someone that potentially is not like that and is more on the safer side who oh who yeah takes doesn't like taking chances in that way where you know yeah because i'm the person that's pretty risky and too much sometimes mm. where i think that balance is okay oh, yeah true but, for sure um also yes in the car like just because they're a car person doesn't mean they all race either some of them uh, did just build cars and right. they just drive peacefully true. and they're not racers right. like they just are enthusiasts, right? Yeah. I but wonder if that will, at some point, kind of bore you, though. 
you know, mm -hmm. like you're driving fast. He's on the passenger side. He's like, honey, <laughs> honey, <laughs> <I> was, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honey, <laughs> slow down. Yeah. I mean, it's hard. I see the pros and cons of being in a relationship with someone that shares the same passion as you. Right. You know, could you could you go out it's with a, ra a female rapper? I could go out a female rapper, yeah. but I'm not trying to freestyle. With her <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Exactly. I mean, you don't know? you have that inkling in the back of your head? Like, I'm faster than this motherfucker. <laughs> you know, like I'm, well, I'm a better driver. There's than a this. lot of great car couples I know, and it works out great. But oh, yeah. for me personally, yeah. I would love, I think, my next to be in a total different industry. So mm. I come home, learn something like different or I, yeah. into something different. I would say going back to back from a five to seven year relationships mm -hmm. like those relationships seem like they actually work. I mean, For sure. those aren't short relationships. Yeah. They shouldn't last it they that should. long. <laughs> yeah. And, but yeah. they're just um, going in circles. You know? chilling, those yeah. are long distance relationships, <laughs> if you will. Oh, I've never tried those. A few laps <laughs> extra. A lot of mileage on those <laughs> no, relationships. I, I can say. see people being intimidated by what you do. Oh, yeah. I'm actually, it's been a conversation these days with friends. Like, they sit me down. They're like genuinely worried. They're like, oh. my closest friends that know, they're, that know me, they're like, so are you gonna like marry one day? Yeah. Like you you have have you been like dating? Like they mm -hmm. literally because when people on the outside they're like Sarah probably has so much guys like so much blah blah. blah. I'm like yeah. dude I have zero. I talk to zero. Like mm. I don't get hit on. I don't like talk That's to guys. That's weird because the industry is mostly like it's male driven, right? Yeah, yeah. super yeah, male driven. So. And I think not. I think I know that's part of the case, and I've been told that too. Yeah, because people on the outside that don't know the industry, it's intimidating. I'm in a male dominated industry. I'm yeah. with around like masculine like drivers and men, and I do something that society would say it's for males mm. right i get all that i'm aware of well it, you know so. what well, knowing sarah too she, you are into a lot of different things that are considered necessarily nerd culture but it's funny nowadays because there is no like nerd uniform at all yeah right? it's like you can see like some crazy model supermodel looking dude to a girl hot sure. influencer girl but they can be into nerdy things yeah and there's no like it's not like, oh, putting your glasses up and you know what so I mean? So when you say nerdy, you mean gaming, huh? Is that, <laughs> is that? <laughs> and it's weird because like, I don't know, like I'm not into necessarily nerd culture things. Yeah. You know, like I'm not, I'm not a gamer. I'm not an anime head. Yeah. And all these things. <laughs> and, and it's funny because when I was growing up, I thought I was a nerd. But I realized I wasn't. Into I, I had to hey, disagree rap, with yeah. that because battle rapping was, like I said, <laughs> one of the nerdiest <laughs> sportings. That's that actually I've pretty nerdy. Seen. It is. It's it really is. Okay. smart and witty, like yeah. poetic poem shit. You're rhyming words. You're the best yeah. rhymer <laughs> in the game. Yeah, literally. That's what you're winning. You know oh how what are those um, stages called where people like watch poem reading people? A slam, slam, A slam poetry. Yeah, yeah, but that boy just hip hop version. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this guy got Doug funny character <laughs> yeah. dolls, and he's saying he's not nerdy over here. Okay. Okay. Shut the fuck the, up. The bro. one thing that is nerdy is I like collecting things and yeah. I, I like I, I like scrapbook. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I'm a like I'm a like I like being a historian and a collector of sorts. Yeah. I have tons of like old footage and photographs and flyers that I put in a scrapbook. Yeah. yeah. I remember when you were really into Pokemon cards. I mean, but when you're young, you're into no, no, that's I, I, like young. What are you talking about? This was like last, last year. year. No, 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 no. It's my yeah, 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 yeah. My nephew saw... is into Pokemon, so I got a Pokemon. No, I've seen you open them and like post about them. Yeah. Like you bought bought. No, but that's different. That? Yeah, is but that, that's like that the flip. Funny? That's that's the, I mean, uh, the essence think, of hard. I culture. didn't even attempt to holla. <laughs> Who said that? One? Uh, one of, I don't know. One of the chat, they're like, oh, yeah. if I had a known, though. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, someone tried to holler at you. What, <laughs> but you say you didn't. What, what would which be, is fine. I, I'm sure DM, you know, DMs is one of those, like, what you kind of mentioned of dudes trying to holler with, like, something they're trying to relate to. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like the classic so thing. Annoying. The classic yeah, is yeah. like, you know, yeah. they post, like, some food spot, mm -hmm. you know, and you're like, oh, I love that spot. Right, right, right. <laughs> you know, like, so kind of yeah. like. Oh, quick, yeah, I know yeah, what you yeah, mean. Yeah, yeah. Relatability, <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, I feel. I feel like car. I mean, there there's a little level of intimidation. I think with the the world that yeah. you kind of come from, for sure. For sure. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, no, yeah. for sure. I I one time like I took a guy I like to like an event, and then I did some drifting out of mm -hmm. nowhere, and then it was like all men and you know men drivers, big like dudes from like like Russia or something, yeah. or Italy, like just all saying what's up too, and then it's, they're literally just homies. Like yeah, I literally did not have a thing with any mm. car guy before unless my ex and so like but they don't know that you know they yeah. assume as a guy yeah. which i think they're just not confident mm. yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. i learned that there. yeah for yeah. sure for sure so i just learned now i gotta just to shift gears right confident. so like when you're <laughs> <laughs> when, when, when were you waiting to <laughs> the, the timing too. <laughs> i swear <laughs> the time 
I, I just want to know the mechanics of um, you know when you're drifting. You know that big ass bar. <laughs> that is that the parking uh, is the that hydro e brake? Oh, it's a hydro e brake. Oh wait, the one up here or your just so your yeah. E-brake? I mean, this is your e brake, but right. then, don't you have another big ass one like the shifter? Oh, no, 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 no. I know the shift. So is that the e-brake that you're using to drift? Yeah. So, you know, your stock (laughs) e-brake. Yeah. That's a stock e-brake, but you can swap that into a hydro e-brake. So it's up here and it's easier to drift. Wow. Okay. Because then like this takes a lot. They both take a lot of muscle. Yeah. But it's easier to do it from here. Where does one practice drifting? Like, Um, where does one? Yeah, like if I was to Legally, start, yeah, at the track, there's a lot of like. You can say at the church. <laughs> there's a at the Porsche church. track. Right? Oh my god! Mm-hmm. Hey, so did you rap before in churches in Hawaii? I did I, I one. Feel like yeah, you have yeah. Oh at god. SCC or KCC. No, no, or AKUMC. Something. Yeah, 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 yeah. <gasps> That's yeah, yeah. my childhood church, and someone it's like told an old me church, that. Right? Yeah, with Sunny and over I, there. No, Pastor V or something. Yeah, white guy, yeah. right? <gasps> what? Yeah, I was there, and I She's don't remember. There, bro. Yeah. Dude, someone That's brought crazy. it up to me. They're like, hey, do you know that um, Yak's um, Rick guy? I was yeah. like, yeah, yeah. He's like, dude, you know he rapped at our church before when we were that's there that's and i was like nuts. what yeah that's so, crazy what do you what do you rap at church no because no was, no i was a, i was a, a christian, christian rapper, rapper back then yeah whoa so what are the lyrics like uh it was it was not too like heavy like bible verses but uh-huh. it was more like be happy love you know it was very yeah. positive raps you know oh. I, I did a lot of like storytelling stuff like that. That's crazy though, because I remember that show. Yeah. It's a lot I was of there. It, it's a lot of you were there. I think so. Wow. Yeah. It's, yeah. You made yeah. no impact on her life. Apparently. <laughs> uh, <laughs> she sped away. She's like, um, I think I'm gonna go to cars. Uh, I'm out of here. <laughs> she went skirt. <laughs> no, that's crazy. Did Jerk you have a partner? Sudden. Or was it yeah, by yourself? Yeah, Manifest back in the day. <gasps> yeah. yeah. Manifest. Peter. She took the highway to hell. She just, um, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be all night. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but I was going to say, um, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, so you were at, you performed at her church. Yeah. And this was in Hawaii. I remember that show because that was the first time I met like a older Korean lady who was like, like my mom's age speaking perfect english mm. you know out in hawaii like i was speaking in korean i was like oh yeah yeah and then she'd be like oh no no i, I speak perfect english. and then that that blew my mind it was like a moment of disillusionment but that's just that's crazy that you were there that was a while ago i, know. I was like 10 plus when years i heard ago. that i was like that's so random that's so random that's crazy so did you learn any wait how long were you there for uh i wasn't there for a while okay. i was he there used for to like, tour ch- like churches wow yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Must be, oh, that's awesome. That tour must be crazy. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's wild. It gets bro. wild. Over there. So with a cool. spirit, bro. Yeah, that's literally my childhood church. When did you move out? When did you move away from Hawaii? Uh, I lived up until 21. Then I moved to Japan for like almost a year. Wow. And then I moved to LA because I met my ex in Japan. Mm. Wow. Should have been there longer, but. Yeah, I mean, not to get too deep into it, but that's very. Like, admirable like you left home at 15 just did your thing went to japan at 21 20 20 yeah did your mom ever find out that you were well oh obviously well, but yeah me and my mom are best friends now but mm. we didn't speak for a little bit it's a long, for like a few years and yeah, then i journey. think after you move out and they feel that like loss ish of course you want to now bond yeah, so yeah. now it's completely opposite and but with the driving you know like do they get Oh yeah, she's scared. surprisingly she's never been against it, and oh, cause cool. I think cause when I left, and then by the time like I was doing my thing, she wanted to be a part of my life. Right. So it wasn't where like she was like, no, don't do it. Then it's mm-hmm. more strictness, more controlling than I would have been like, no. Uh, 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 then but I she's drifted been. with you. Oh, I, I mean, <laughs> yeah. There's a video where there's like video. she kind of so pranks funny. her, hops on for, she, she hops in for a ride. <laughs> I love that. It just feels like genuine. Like that's like pretty much, bitch. What are you doing? You know, yeah, like, yeah, that yeah. kind of shit. Because I left bitch. my GoPro on to like really play it cool. Like earlier in the day, like oh, I just like this is my dash cam. She's like, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Something. So I just left it on the whole day <laughs> as we're going to like all her errands, and then I just pulled that's one so to make funny. her reaction supernatural. 
<laughs> let me let me ask you this because um do you are is the car community or you in particular like do you feel kind of nervous about the pot the future of like that culture as like things are getting more electric and stuff mm -hmm. you know because it, it has like a classic feel to it at That's this true. point too right. right yeah um i think i've accepted the circumstances because global warming is real and i get it it is but at the same time i'm not worried i'm just more sad mm. that it is the case mm -hmm. which is you know things always change yeah and it's not like i mean for my timeline and what i want to do i eventually want to get married and have kids i'm not going to be drifting crazy yeah. all young and free yeah. for a long time because as a mother mother figure i don't want to be all dangerous and be a good like you know if but, they um, if your kids wanted to drift be a drifter would you um, or a professional driver no i i guess you know the culture so well yeah so, right. if they really want to and some i'm not gonna like fucking drown mm. them in the culture and stuff and i'll like you know expose them to it and then be like yeah mom used to do this maybe or something <laughs> i don't know but what um, is Oh, no, I ahead, think sorry. they would have to stem from like a genuine place of why they get into culture. I don't want them to do it just because I did or they yeah. just find it cool. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because uh -huh. I feel like now, like hip hop and stuff like that, a lot of like music are hyping up cars so much, like mm. JDM cars especially, and it's popping. It's like hype. And sometimes I think it's been taking away from the culture so mm -hmm. much. Mm -hmm. That's what's starting like the takeovers. Because now right. it's becoming like There's this hip hop culture, right? And there are now all these people are like getting all these tuner cars when they don't even know what the fuck it's wow. about. Yeah, and then they're starting all this like ghetto ratchet shit. Those takeovers like, are crazy. So, yeah. so what did the popularity die down and then recently kind of come back like in, in the mainstream? Like, I think it, it, it did. Um, go into the general audience more so now because like Travis yeah. Scott, Khaled, etc. Mm. Like they all promote JDM cars these days. Right. And every single a lot, I get hit up for like music videos and sh shit mm. all the time, yeah. and I'm like, mm, I, I don't bet. know about that one. Yeah. And, like, mm. and they just love it. It's like the aesthetic now. It's the vibe. Right. And like a lot of internet people too, like they post it as an aesthetic with zero culture behind it, and they're like. Like so many fashion brands too, they're making motorsports jackets with That's like true. with like emblems that don't even make sense or yeah. not even well curated with each other. And the I'm poser just, yeah, culture is crazy, literally. Right? And then so now that transfers into like takeover yeah. culture people, which that audience speaks That's for itself. That's true. That that kind of stuff is like a double edged sword where you know it one in one hand it does help advance the culture, but right. on the other exactly. hand it takes away from people who've been in it and really have been part of bringing that culture to life right? exactly. even has a more negative connotation to it too sometimes exactly. you know like sometimes i s like there was takeovers in k-town and people are tagging me like yo your people yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. sarah where are you at i'm like just because korea tell me that's not right. my fucking people and then um law enforcement is going to look at that like all these fucking car people and generalize sure. it exactly with everybody and then make more things strict and then the culture it's just so you feel like it's disrespectful for that <sighs> it's it makes it so that it's just I'm. I know that those takeover people mm -hmm. don't get what they're doing because mm. they don't know. Right, right, right. Yeah, it's they're just, doing it, it for the hype. It's like exciting for the the yeah. people around on the streets. Like, what's going on? Mm -hmm. This right. seems crazy. It's against the authority. You know what I'm saying? All I see is people getting hit, hit. dying, run Yo, over, and it's. I saw that one clip of of a girl. She's dead, and they're propping her up. Oh no! You know, it's oh fucking. Oh god, that's like some kind of purge shit. Like that. I the love fuck? it. Let me ask you, um, what? What does Fast and the Furious mean to the culture? Let's go. Oh, that's a good question. <laughs> I'm curious. Like, what is that? Fast mean? and Furious? Are you talking about the movie? Yeah. Like, no, what, what, it, what, is, what else is there? <laughs> I don't know. The feeling. Like, no, the I don't know if you use it as a phrase. The porn like parody. <laughs> <laughs> the porn parody. No, She's no. like, are you trying to be funny? <laughs> no, no. I'm just I know. I was like, right? never, no one ever to ask <laughs> well, you it's that like, before. Well, it's kind of the only car right. franchise that's ever really I mean, it's gone the eight, this It's far. the eight mile of racing, isn't it? I would say it's similar in the aspect where it is a community. Yeah. And it can get... Like, you know, like Tokyo Drift, right? Like the parking lot scene. Yeah. Like it can get like that, but not so where everyone's like. Right. Oh God, like like music video. Like, <laughs> like, yeah, with, the, with their computers out like that. Yeah. yeah. And no, then, like, I'm saying do, car, do car pe culture people love this, love the franchise? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys they like fuck it. with it, but I think more so all the older ones. Yeah. Oh. Till it got too Hollywood. Like now they go to the moon. Like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh y'all yeah. don't do that. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> like, and then they somehow came back in like an open air. Right. But, um, right. Yeah. Now it obviously became super Hollywood, but I think 
at the tip of from like Tokyo Drift to all the older ones, they fuck with hard. Because uh, you were messing with cars during that time too, right? Yeah, when, since like 2012. Damn. And that must have been math. exciting to see that on, on television, so the, I mean, on, on movie theaters. And I actually only watched half of the Fast and Furious and I also didn't barely watch Initial D. So mm. then when people are like, Oh, so you must, you know, initial mm. D. They always yeah. the first things like initial D or Fast and Furious. I'm like, oh yeah, that's yeah. cool. But I didn't watch. If I was it, to shoot it, my shot, yeah. I would have used the initial. I was, <laughs> like, I was like, you know, initial it's D, like right? Sensationalized. Yeah, but it's okay, fine right? when they bring that up. Like that's yeah, the only yeah. thing they can like <laughs> put two and two together to with, to relate with me. But if you don't know anything <laughs> about cars, though, like if especially trying to holler, like it's it's actually give more respect when you're like, oh, I don't know anything. Yeah. Well, like then they ask for sure. I respect that uh, so much, and I think that's like uh, like attractive. Yeah. Can you modify any car? Yeah. Okay, so if I like got a uh, Toyota Fit, uh-huh. mm-hmm. I can modify that to a Honda Fit. Is it a Honda? Come on, <laughs> already off to bat. <laughs> oh wow. my god! No, 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 hold on, hold on. First of all, I said that because I modified the Honda into a Toyota Fit. <laughs> you son of a okay, bitch. Okay, uh, yeah, no. Yeah. So a Honda Fit. Uh huh. If I got that, uh-huh. I could actually modify that as well. Dude, Honda Fits are so popular to modify. They are. Yeah. Oh, okay. Super popular. How about a Ford Focus? You can modify anything. Mm-hmm. It's just the question is either tastefully, yeah, or because mm. also a lot of cars you think of it as like a like a black canvas of whatever the body lines are and true, stuff. True, true. Mm. So it's really hard to work with unless or make it tasteful, and it's your own perspective because right. the general audience. Let's say like you build like a O2 Camry. Yeah. Like to you, it must be dope. It's unique to build or whatever to you, right? But right. the general audience is like, "Oh, that's still wild." Yeah. Yeah. So it's teach their own. Uh, yeah. right. You know what I mean? I mean, everything's but modifiable. But you can literally modify anything. Come on, Don. We saw a pin my ride. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, they can <laughs> do, do you, all that. What do you think about uh, Miatas? Oh yeah, they're so popular. Do you? Do you they're do still you and they're now they're crazy expensive. Everything old school. Th- I wish I kept everything. Everything yeah. like uh. I bought like a uh, Miatas back then used to be like fifteen hundred. Yeah. Now they can go for like ten fifteen k. Are you serious? For a clean one, yes. Right. My S two thousand. Well, it is a um like a rarer version of S two thousands. I bought that ten years ago for thirty k. Now. Not at my quality, my miles and stuff, but a super clean one, 100K easily Whoa. over. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, 150 I would easily. I never think that about Fucking car. crazy. That's I love the S2000. The Hondas, especially uh. like the famous, like um, the most popular ones from like EKs to hatches to like Accords mm. to Integras and stuff. Crazy expensive. Yeah. Even in Japan, like over 10K, 15K. When you can buy those for like even like 2K mm. back yeah. then. Are, are you Are you into motorcycles? No. That's not your thing. She's mm. a four wheeler. Four wheeler. Yeah, that's a whole thing. You. I you, think. <laughs> not yeah. a big fan of the two wheelers. No, I'm a I'm a fan. I respect it, but yeah. I got into a really bad moped accident on a moped oh. cruise. Oh shit. Um, when I was like in high school, because we would all like Hawaii, so you know, yeah, we had, yeah, like, yeah. Fifty of us yeah, like yeah, looking yeah, like a moped up. gang, yeah. Yep. And then um. I crashed into two of my friends, <laughs> and then one had to get like a tetanus shot. One like dislocated her shoulder. Crazy. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, so and then after that, I was like, mm, I don't know about. Yeah. yeah. Every so, time I'm on those like two wheelers, I, I, it's different. It hits different for me. Is it? I, I always wondered how when someone gets in an accident and something they do right, like how they bounce back from it after that trauma. Because mm-hmm. you know, I used to skateboard, <laughs> as many people may know, I was yeah. quite good. Um, and I, <laughs> one time, laughing already. one time I ollied in a parking lot. I said ollie, that sounded yeah. not good, but it was uh, a prolly. Right? <laughs> no, I ollied and then I fell on my hand and because I fell so hard back, I, I caught the ground and it snapped my, right. uh, um, what is this called? The wrist. wrist. Yes. It's called, it's called, it snapped that. And after that, I felt like I was less um adventurous with mm-hmm. my tricks oh yeah and, we see. and, and um yeah more less extreme with my tricks and because I, I was like traumatizing my right. head I, i'm sure that would happen with an accident in like oh, a yeah. car as well yeah right? it's so mental and it's really just all mental and right. you have to overlap that with being riskful again mm. and so it's like for drifting right like for instance in normal driving if you're about to hit a wall you break but you, I have to swap over to a different mentality and drifting because you're going faster to the right. wall. You're yeah. speeding, mm. and then yeah. you we we break at the very last like minute <sighs> on full speed versus normal autopilot driving mode. You slow down and slower down. Yeah, yeah. but we're we want to go faster. Yeah, and then at the last minute we drift. Oh my so gosh. it's a different mental to yeah. swap into, and you're 
You guys are literally You're, facing death yeah, every yeah. turn. And crashing and drifting is, oh my god, no, 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 not that one. Don't what play is that this? One. <laughs> is this a video of you? Don't play that one. <laughs> <laughs> what is this video? It's, oh, it's uh, for drifting. Uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, let's put it on the screen. Let's take a look. Let's take a look so at her. Cool. This First of all, that's a sexy car. <laughs> it's not pink anymore. I had to. Is that your car? It. Is that it's, you? Now it's blue. Yeah, it's me. Wow. Whoa! That's crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ooh. That's crazy. That, that is slow mo cool. looks so cool. It is really is like it? a power puff transformer. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> that that shit looks so dope. Who's a? Uh, this was in Texas. Wow. Whose car is that? That's what is that? A Lexus? Looks like my uh, dad. G thirty five. Yes. G thirty five. And I just she in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. But yeah, that's. I mean. Yeah, we know that after that uh, wrist break, now you just collect skateboards with no wheels on it. You know what I mean? There's no trust on any of Yeah, there's like a bunch there's, on this yeah, wall. A, no trust. It's art now. <laughs> it's <laughs> yeah, exactly. I, I've always, um, you know, I recently, it's funny because back in the day mm -hmm. when I was growing up, it was like the Asian, the cool Asian kids were into the cars, uh -huh. you know, um, uh, all the modification of cars. And I oh, was kind of, and how old are you? I'm 36. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> God damn. God damn. Go. You were there. You had cars yeah. back then. <laughs> it was a Ford T model. Um, yeah. <laughs> no. Um, but, uh, yeah, so so back then, it was all the cool Asian kids that had those, and I wasn't into that culture, you know? Uh, like, yeah. I was, I, that's when I said I, I was, con I thought I was, I considered myself to be nerdy. Yeah. Because I wasn't in the cool Asian. Your cool skateboarders were cool, right? Yeah, but they're more, they were like more outcast. Oh, they're more the broke. We were yeah. like more stoner, like, you right, know, right, and, right. and then the, the car kids was like the cool Asian kids, you know, that hung out with each other, hot import nights and all that. Mm -hmm. Oh my, back then. I used to battle at hot import nights too. Yeah. Wow, really? that's yeah. back back then. Yeah, I was back yeah. in a day. Yeah. All right. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> mileage. <laughs> yeah. Gee, that's a lot of mileage on yeah. me. Oh my goodness. There is a no, lot. I'm kidding, I'm Even kidding. where I came from in Virginia, we had a lot of races, a lot of pink slip races. You know, I thought was, you guys only had white people. There. No, relax, no, 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 I'm kidding. Dude, That's not relax, the I'm yeah. talking about. <laughs> no, no, but there was a road called Edsel Road in this. Uh, it was a very famous strip where it, it was like an industrial area, and we'd always have meetups like every Saturday. Ooh. I say we, like I was part of it, but I would go and check it out. People would lose their cars, like you know, give up pink slips and stuff like that. Have you ever done stuff like Whoa. that? No, that's back then. Too. Yeah, that, all right, yeah, that's that's. <laughs> my young told me about this, not me. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, like rarely, yeah, but. But it, that shit was, really happened. It, it like people happen. would gamble their whole fucking oh, car. Yeah, yeah. back then in specific cases and yeah. groups, but not usually. Have you ever seen somebody, you know, try to show off or like try to flex a little bit and then fuck up their car? Because I've seen videos of that, you know, like when they're drifting and they lose control like right away and then they just smash. That must not well, feel cool. Well, that's part of drifting. And sometimes we purposely hit each other. What? So, so. So crashing and accidents and drifting is very normal. Mm. So I'm so jaded by like accidents. So when an accident happens, I'm already like, oh shit, let's take a photo of it. Like normal accidents right. too. I'm not like panicked ever. Cause it happens. So in drifting, you want to, and we like also like while we're tandeming with each other, tandem is like side by side. Right. We hit our doors as a signal to like, come closer. Don't be a bitch. Like Jesus. hit me, Whoa. tap me, tap me, tap me. Yeah. It's part of culture. And then, Drifting, just even though there's a really good driver in the car, sometimes the car fucks up, like the like the yeah. um, arms or something, yeah. you know. Yeah. So the car just like ends up spinning out, or you kind of miss, um, like just did something wrong, so you crash, and yeah, that's part of the sport. What Bro, kind of, what kind of? You, I, I'm curious, actually. Have you, you know, in movies they mm -hmm. always like the race is to win the boy, the girl, or something. Like, mm. have you ever had an experience where you? won or lost something like since you're young like on the streets to like when you're racing somebody no i think like, racing for m all my exper experiences was all like ego mm. and a lot of guys would react so toxically ego uh -huh. tistical towards me if i won Damn. all the time give me an example i mean of a bitch. i mean ever since i was 15 like till today yeah. today i deal with so much for sure. Egotistical men, sure. toxic in the masculinity. So this is women. I, I mean, this is women in every yeah, field yeah, and yeah. industry. Yeah. You know, yeah. they, it's just it's it's. If you look, go on the internet, yeah. go under any post about women, it's yeah. like men absolutely just hate women. Yeah. 
for no reason. Oh, that makes me feel better. Yeah, yeah. But no, part, it, is, shit, it is in every I'm just, I'm just industry, being real. Yeah. I, I look at that shit. I'm all like, these motherfuckers are like terrible. Yeah. You yeah. know, like they for no reason. And yeah. we see that obviously with some of the more publicized things, whether it's for like sure. Megan Thee Stallion or mm-hmm. this or that. It's just like. But on top of that, especially in the culture of driving where they say like women can't drive and then she's better than them. You know, mm-hmm. that's an uppercut to the face, bro. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. <laughs> that's All the crazy. Time. Hmm. And like, well, when in the beginning, when I was 15, like if I won, dumb excuses like, oh, my tires were bought. I had five people in my car. Or like, <laughs> yeah. you're tuned. Or I'm not. I wasn't even tuned. Or like wow. stuff like that. Always excuses to other yeah. guys. Right. And then now these days, it's like more like they show passive aggressiveness with mm. ego, like meeting me or like interactions and mm. stuff like that. And I. Now, now I don't take it personal. Y- huh? It's just like they want to kick out of like right. making me feel some type of way, so they yai me on me all yeah. the time. That's why you got. Uh, that's why you women have to date more dudes that are not better at them at stuff. Mm. You know what I mean, I grew up very used to not being better than things <laughs> than women. Right. You know what I mean. Yeah. And so I feel comfortable. It's second place to women. <laughs> or is someone in a different issue where we both respect each other's right. talents or whatever? Mm. Yeah. And embrace it. And now, fast forward to now, you're getting branding deals here and there. Thank you for, by the way, for that Call of Duty. Hey, that was nuts. <laughs> oh, so, did you work with Activision or? No, 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 no. I just pulled up there. Oh, pulled My up friend there? Um, okay. invited me, and then I was like, I don't play Call of Duty. <laughs> yeah. I play Valorant, but I wanted to see the sport. Yeah. And then, um, I was like, who plays? on call of duty and then i i think i hit up rec because that time rec also joins me and my yeah. other gamer friends a yeah. lot and then he was like oh rick plays call he's like a heart like he's the fan and i was like okay so i hit him perfect. up and i was like thank here's the so code much. thank you so much of course uh, when did you become a gamer um covid i didn't Bru- become oh, really? a gamer yeah i, I to one spend- does not become a gamer <laughs> <laughs> the game yeah. finds yeah. them yeah. <laughs> He's like, when did you become? <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's true. Yeah, and then Valorant came out during COVID, but yeah. also gaming wise, like we talk, we can talk about like back then from Pokemon. Like I'm a huge Pokemon fan. Mm. I played every single. Got you. And then um, now I am sim racing. So I just set yeah. up like a full blown three screen. Um, oh, that sim looks racing. fun. Yeah, you guys should come over and try. Is it similar hell yeah. to the feeling of driving? So there's no G force. Yeah, right? but. It's really hard to get used to in the beginning because you are counting on your like yeah. momentum Could and the you. feel of the car. But now it's all literally about just strategy and timing. Yeah, but yeah. I set it up perfectly. <laughs> Alex is on yeah, it. Alex is on <laughs> it. Actually, Rec has the same setup for porn. It's crazy. <laughs> it's insane. Three screens. Yeah, um, flashlight. Yeah, all types <laughs> of stuff. It's insane. Yeah, and so um, I, I, I set it up with quality. Um, parts like the wheel the um the pedals especially does, I the, can does, control. The, does the wheel kind of rumble and stuff like oh that? yeah it shakes what? vibrates everything that's fire uh-huh. it's it has full-on power steering and then my pedals too i can adjust every um like the the brain fart but anyways yeah like, the like pressure. everything yeah 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 and then it even has it. the audio of her mom be like shangyana <laughs> <laughs> You're taking a right here, aren't you? <laughs> dampening, dampening, yeah. And then, um, yeah, you guys should try. Yeah. There's a game called Assetto Corso that's really... I love that There's shit. a huge um, sim racing co- uh, community yeah. as well. Yeah, So yeah. I'm, I'm trying to hop into that. Assetto's same. fun as shit. There's yeah. a place in Culver City. My friend, had, he's a car guy, and he mm-hmm. had like a party there. It was so fun. Rod? Mm. Yeah, yeah, Rod. Whoa. Yeah. No, I, Our, I see her at like... Porsche events and sometimes we have mutual friends. Yeah, yeah. I know. I go to so many weird, random like car oh things. God, is that is that a nickname or is that a real name? <laughs> Call what? me Rod, Hot Rod. <laughs> <laughs> he does. It's love our mutual Rod. friend. Yeah, yeah, Rod. I know Rod. I know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you <laughs> did. I know Rod. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we went to his house. Yeah. Remember that yeah, one Yeah, I saw a simulator and all the stuff. Oh, yeah. I think I was supposed to go to that, but I couldn't. His dinners and stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. If <laughs> that's funny, if you had a simulator, you get a girl over. You want to see my simulator? It just seems like. But I think he has the VR one. I can't do that. I'll throw up oh, immediately. Wow. You gotta wear that. That is what it was. Yeah. yeah. No, he has the Oculus. That's so crazy. you're you're doing a simulator against the wall. Yeah. <laughs> with a VR, but I'll throw up. Right. I can't do those. What what's on, on your dating profile? Do you have pictures of you in your car? Ooh. I heard. <laughs> You said on your on, dating, on your dating profile. profile. Yeah. No, I don't have a dating. You profile. don't have a dating profile. No. no. Really? No. One time, though, a long time ago, in like, you're not on Drifter. <laughs> <laughs> I give that a six. All right, sorry. <laughs> I was trying to keep up with this guy. God damn. 
Uh. I get it though. Anyways, one time I made one. My friend made one with me, and then immediately, not trying to be like cocky or anything, but like people were like, "Is this Sarah?" and whatever. Yeah. And then I deleted it right quick, and then mm. the next day I got like screenshot DMs. I like, yo, like there's a fake profile. Like I'm like, yeah, so yeah. fake. Oh my god, <laughs> shit, <laughs> fucking god. So, so these you pretended fake to be people these days. Yeah, pretended no to be life. Catfish. Do something better. Yeah. Jesus, <laughs> Did you have car stuff? Me. Would you? No, I, no. I completely never ever. I, I remember when I made it, I was like, yeah, no car stuff. I don't oh, want okay. stupid messages or right. like. Oh, that's just, true. It's like a full on. I I would. You know, I know. Do you listen to any are. music while you drift? Or is it Oh complete? my, oh my God. <laughs> 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 what people think I listen right, to. Right, right, what right, I'm right. really <laughs> listening to. Yeah. No, no, no. Well, yeah. Move, bitch. <laughs> get out the way. <laughs> <laughs> but reality. Yeah. No? I, I like the a, a Charlie XX song. Remind, like, I was, have you heard that one? Hot Girls? Mm-mm. And no. they go, vroom, vroom, that song. <laughs> I imagine she's I, a I don't know if she's like, that on the know. <laughs> it's not like making my way downtown. <laughs> it's, a, it's a little too on the. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, I listen to hyphy shit sometimes. There's right. a lot of like, um, yeah. like there's a guy I know that makes really good drift music. I think it's good for. Mm. It's like his name is Harper. Okay. Mm. Or um, kind of like it's like trappy. Oh, yeah, okay. like super fast rap. Right, 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 like right. Busta rhyme shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. but like oh. gotcha. trap. Yeah, gotcha. yeah, yeah. It's like hard. So, so you like you, there is a energy in the car that you want. It's like Suicide Boys vibe, right, right, right. Mixed with like you know. I got you. Yeah, yeah. I, got yeah. You. I will. I will say though, like depending on the the hypeness of the music, it does make me accelerate. Come on, G. Does that ever happen? <laughs> Are you oh, yeah. serious? The music sure. has a huge impact. Yeah. 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 You forget how heavy your foot is when you're listening yeah, to Yeah, like, I'm like, yo, turn that bus off. It's a 35-mile <laughs> zone right here, bro. <laughs> Shit. Remember we were listening to Dame Gasolina? <laughs> you were speeding your ass off, bro. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> it's scary. Yeah. I, I'll tell you a story. I remember one time I was dating this girl, and she was going through some stuff, and we have also weren't in a good place, I think, and we went on a road trip yeah i fell asleep in the car i woke up and she was going 120 on the freeway oh crying my. are and you I, serious yeah, and i woke up to it and i was like this yeah. was terrifying well first of all if you guys are in a bad space and you're fighting and then you fall asleep bro well, I, I was on a road trip and i woke up and she why. was bawling yeah. going 120 on the freeway like BPD. yeah that was today's the day we both died no no you know? yeah like, like... yeah i wasn't trying to have all that but it was very it was scary <laughs> yeah I was yeah, like, sweetie, <laughs> everything's okay, right, sweetie? <laughs> We're all good, right? Oh, man. I mean, shit. Uh, that really happens to people, though. Yeah. Yeah. What's the fastest you've gone on the road? Uh, Two weeks ago. What's past, like, 180 kilometers? 180 kilometers? kilometers? Oh Kilometer. This was in... Oh, Alex, was convert it. Wait, but, like... That's one... I think that's, like, 111.8 something. Yeah, so, something. my... It was going... So, Japan... Um. Uh, it was it goes that's the cap 180 oh, so okay. the line was past oh I, I don't yeah, know. yeah 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 mm-hmm. so that was the recent one i've been you're maxing it out mm-hmm. have you ever been on the autobahn yet the auto the autobahn? in germany like there's this one road there's no speed there's no speed limit all <gasps> oh, right it's no, like I've, it's like it's like the racer's germany, dream yeah. road you know where yeah. is that i've never <sighs> been to germany yeah, oh. yeah. how are, are you good at mario kart <laughs> like, does it make you better? Are you? Uh, I I'm not. I'm not. I mean the original N64. No, I'm not good at driving games. Yeah. No. Really? Actually, midnight, midnight tuner though. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. I, we I, all remember Need for Speed Underground too, though. Yeah. You remember that yeah. joint? Grand, Grand, Trump, Grand Turismo. Turismo. Dude, in Japan, like at night, we're like we don't, cause I don't drink anymore too. So when yeah. we have nothing to, I was like, yo, let's go to the arcade. So we would always go and we find midnight tuner, and there's yeah. a bunch of like Japanese kids all like, like <laughs> all hard and shit there, and I'm like. <laughs> So I'm like over there, like. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know cars. <laughs> How about like, that NASCAR? I'm like fucking beat these fools, huh? Is NASCAR a thing? Like, are you are you a fan? Oh, that's a whole that's different. That's a whole different yeah. thing. Yeah. So think of car uh, motorsports as like music, like EDM, hip hop, damn, um, R and B. Like it's total different worlds. Got some you. fuck with each other, some don't. But like, what are you guys dubstep or something? Oh, we're talking. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's your genre? Um, like trap, trap, or like mix okay. of hip hop yeah. with EDM. Grand Prix like. would be like classical music, or yeah, NASCAR's country probably. Yeah. Hip hop, <laughs> yeah. hip hop too, because I feel like drifting's pretty cool. That's true. Generally, yeah. Fuck yeah. objectively, yeah. 
Hell yeah. Yeah, NASCAR. I don't Country. Even, honestly, I don't even know like how NASCAR mm. and all those like I don't even watch F1 mm. or mm. all the karting stuff because it's yeah. a whole different. It's it's a whole different culture. And, off, and then off yeah, roading w- is its own little thing. Ooh, too. I want to get into off roading yeah. actually. Yeah, I think I'm getting older. I want a Rav Four. Yeah. And I, or and my Hawaii side's kicking mm-hmm. into where I want like a Four Runner. Right, mm-hmm. right. Like it just like a yeah. around. like a Tacoma. Yeah, because and, and my whole team in Hawaii grew up with Filipinos, mm. and they're all like fa- they all just have off roaders now. Yeah, mm. and they just all like around and i'm like Ooh. what's your least yeah. favorite car of all time least that's a favorite. good question favorite i don't know that's we can circle back on that okay yeah. we'll circle back what's your <laughs> what was your first car mine was a volvo s40 it was a very safe car. volvo s40 yeah. those are tanks it's that's the opposite of a drifting car <laughs> no that's uh, the safest car you can get yeah 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 uh, my, my aunt had one of those like it's it's metal, all metal. It's like a tank. It's How heavy. about you? What was your first car? My first car. Let me tell you this. My first car. So my parents had the dry cleaners, right? So they gave me one of the dry cleaning delivery vans. It was a oh, Chevy man. Astro. <laughs> it was a white Chevy Astro van. But mind you, during the time that I was driving this, the DC Sniper had the same exact van. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Do you guys remember yeah, DC yeah. Sniper? Yeah. John Lee Malvo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So after class, I'd be driving back to the cleaners um, to work. And I get pulled over. Yeah. Guns drawn, right? Oh, my God. And then God. they're coming up to the car. And this happened like three, four times. Right. So they gave me like a Fairfax County Public, I mean, police sticker. Right. To let people know that it's not me. Oh, oh. my God. Like, literally, there's so many times I'm like this. And then at the end, they found out it wasn't even a Chevy Astro. It was like wrong, uh, like wrong reporting. But because of that time... Yeah, it was bad, man. Like I would, Damn. but the van was cool because I would pick up all my friends. Yeah, and we didn't have seats in the back because it was a dry cleaning van. We just had monkey parts, so they would just hold, Jesus hang on Christ. like this. No, that's that's crazy. That's the same vehicle. It was the same. Vehicle. I remember that time. Too. Yeah, that yeah. must have been a nightmare. As yeah, they were trying definitely. To find that. Uh, no girls. <laughs> okay, I don't think I have a car that I hate. I can't think of, but yeah. I avoid a lot of muscle cars when mm. i'm driving they are there is stereotypes that are real mm. and i feel like they are super obnoxious and my car is really loud as in like mm. visu- visually yeah it's yellow and you know and so they always try to test me and especially when they see a female <sighs> yeah it what gets it? even worse and sometimes like a oh. lot of people call me out on freeways a lot yeah. to race and stuff mm. i get in trouble with them and how, how, I'm sorry not to cut you off. No, no, no. How do you prompt a race? Like, how do you? Do you make eye contact? Yeah, because like in a thing? video game, you put L one and R one together like this to like to like <laughs> <laughs> to, to activate it. But in real life, you know, like you know, yeah. movies they put yeah, down yeah, the window, yeah. they yeah. do the little chin. Uh-huh. What's what's like the most bush? Uh, what's the coolest, most charismatic uh, way to coolest? spark a race? So okay, well, the normal way in Hawaii, every time I would pull up to someone. And then I would do this, which is like one time. <laughs> like this? No, 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 no. Oh, not do this. Do it cooler. Yeah, I'm you, sorry. You don't, you don't move the finger. Yeah. And you shit. <laughs> it's in the wrist. It's an, oh, okay. Yeah, got yeah, you, got yeah, you. It's yeah, in the yeah, wrist. Yeah. Unless you do this. Like, <laughs> yeah, this no, is. No, no, no. You're just looking sassy. <laughs> <laughs> that, you're like, you, you just turn into a Karen. Like, <laughs> <laughs> don't. Yeah, okay, Wait, okay. with a smile or what? So you drive next to them. I is mean, that what you do? Yeah, yeah, I mean, smiling could look creepy too. Right. Like, it's just, it's just part of the whole. You got. It has to come off very <laughs> yeah, yeah 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 like I just pull out I'm just like this and then and then we both downshift and then um Damn. we usually go in our power band which in mine back then I had a Civic so it was about like forty five miles per hour okay and then we go beep 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 and then I'll down it to second and then we go wow. and then to you can get cocky and yeah. so like if you're winning you can um, put on your hazards which yeah. is like you're winning yeah yeah but sometimes yeah. people are so trolly. They already put it on as you're already going <laughs> yeah. and shit like that. It's really fun. And wow. then what's the unspoken rule? Like how far do you go in the race? Do you know what I mean? Like Oh, uh, um well on the freeway it's basically you, you know you who both kind of right? try to go on two lanes where it's an open stretch and mm. there's no cars in front. And if you're on a cruise, people on the cars on the right or behind, they know not to like go in because right. they can read that we're we're all speeding down and For we're sure. both lining up. So it's like a mm. it's like an obvious thing where don't fuck with you know don't cut in or yeah. fuck with our mm. shit and then sometimes it gets bad where when people do or like normal citizens that aren't part of the right. normal city yeah. that part of the cruise they <laughs> civilians. Want, civilians, yeah. 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 civilians 
um we go on like the shoulder lane and stuff and then so you said there was like a lot of stereotypes that come with certain cars and the mm -hmm. drivers right right mm -hmm. so what do you think of someone who drives a tesla like what would be the <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna get so okay. No, so let's last go. time, dude, last time I put a stereotype on FRS drivers. You know, FRS, um, not Scion. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who doesn't know an FRS, <laughs> yeah, right? Vroom, <laughs> 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 vroom. <laughs> G force. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, I I did like on a show. I I was calling out FRS stereotype starter pack. Yeah. I'm so sorry. What is that? Which FRS? was like FRS is um Front row. 86. 86. BRZ. Alex, you got this. Uh, yeah. FRS. Uh, Oh, okay. Got you. Got you. Got you. Got yeah. you. Got you. Yeah. Now they're um, Toyota. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. But anyways, I said a startup. I forgot what I said. Like they love boba. They vape at boba shops. They oh. have an ABG girlfriend, and they drink mm. like Hennessy or something. It was very ABG I stereotype. Got you. Yeah, yeah. 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 And so um, you got a lot of hate or something for that. No. Well, I thought I would. But then it's everyone <laughs> was like, "She ain't wrong." Right. <laughs> and then like, um, cause they were like. Someone asked me, like, oh, they're not real drivers. I'm like, no, usually. And then all the real FRS drivers are like, no, we know how to drive. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck I mean, obviously not. You, you don't apply, but yeah. yeah. How but about what stereotype? Tesla. Tesla. I don't know. That's a hard one, too. That's a specific yeah, thing, Yeah, that's too, too. specific. Cause Content not a lot creator. Of, cause not like, oh, yeah. You know some, like, um, e-commerce shit. It's yeah. like an e-commerce car. For sure. But, um... Tesla is hard. Not a lot of people modify it. But what's popular these days is that they swap EV engines to like normal gas oh, wow. cars. Oh, wow. On, on a Tesla? It's been like a thing. That's mm, weird. Recently. I don't know how factual this claim is, but I heard that batteries is not good for the environment, too. I heard like... Everything isn't. Yeah. Like I heard breathing it's, isn't. Yeah, podcast, probably. Look at this production over here. <laughs> We're using yeah. electricity. Like, like we can never have Greta Thunberg in here, I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> but okay let's take some calls here uh we got a couple of call, uh, calls coming in oh um, we're taking cars oh we call, I mean, call. calls yeah. sorry <laughs> jesus <Calls? laughs> yeah, <that> honk a... <laughs> in <laughs> yeah 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 <clears throat> call in y'all call in everybody um sarah feel free not to answer this question but just uh, -huh. uh are there tips to avoid getting caught by the cops when you're having these street races like is there a system oh, set so up much, or? well as a girl it's easier so i oh, actually yeah. it's like flirt got arrested <laughs> twice yeah and the first time um actually no i i i got away many times in hawaii yeah because i kept dropping my uncle's name because he's a detective in hawaii oh shit all <laughs> and right. then it didn't work eventually <laughs> my luck ran out but all the other times like i remember i would hop on a cruise in my gym clothes yeah and then some like car was trying to race me and then so we raced and then a cop obviously pulled me over because I went on the shoulder lane and yeah. stuff and I pulled over and he's like, he's like, what the fuck are you doing? I was yeah. like, I don't know. Like this guy was like speeding and he kept looking at me and I got oh! so scared. And then like, I'm just like coming from the gym and like, he's like, oh, really? Like, yeah. I was like, yeah, like he went over. And you're in your gym clothes, dude? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Come on. And he's like, he's like, where, where? I'm like, over oh, there. Like that guy was like being so aggressive. <laughs> I was like, what? Oh, you see, that. we can't do that. No, nah, 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 we was can. just coming from the gym. <laughs> oh, yeah. And it was leg day. Yeah. Oh. And then, and then oh all my, my cars God. always had a check engine light because right. I my old two cents. Yeah, I had always like a straight pipe or something, right? And so, like, I would be pulled over to the side on the freeway to mm -hmm. wait for the crews to meet up with them. And then a cop pull over, like, you're not, are you part of the cruise? I'm like, no, yeah. like, there's a, there's a light here. I don't want to yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. my, my, my boyfriend's oh, my coming God. to, like, help me. He's like, oh, okay. Damn. Like, shit like that. It's easy as a girl. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then um, I got dismissed of my racing incident because um, I pulled up, like, tied my hair up, like, innocent makeup, yeah, like, yeah, college yeah. shirt. <laughs> and then, like, the judge, like, out, um, out loud, he was like, your whatever the code is and like for like mm -hmm. illegal mm -hmm. racing and then he looked at me and everyone like looked at me i was like <laughs> <laughs> ding wow dismissed right oh, wow. wow that's <laughs> that's awesome but um yeah my luck you know it's I powerful know. to that's be pretty a... come on let's no, be real yeah. just a girl too and yeah all right. all right let's well, take some calls. all right let's go to mac easy here uh mac is from the uk and he's actually a car guy too so Let's see what Mac. Yeah, I think he's work. He works for F one. He used yeah. to. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. Let's he talk. Used to work What's for up, Mac? What's Hi. up, Mac? A little loud. Hi. Okay. What's up, buddy? I was just at IndyCar. Go ahead. Oh um yeah no um yeah I was just gonna ask um so well actually uh, what's been your favorite car pun this episode because um they've just been 
coming out the gates today. Sorry, what was that? Car What's pun? My... Yeah, car pun. Uh, oh, the I don't joke, know. Car the... joke? Yeah, because you guys have been like, you guys have been bringing it today. Um, I, Rick when was Rick ready said, to go. Let's switch gears. Yeah, switch gears <laughs> that was, was good. good one. <laughs> switch gears was good. <laughs> and then, yeah, I think that was the top one that I can remember. Yeah. Yeah, Dumb had some good nice. ones, I think. Oh, in the stop. <laughs> I don't want to hear your pity. <laughs> your pun pity. <laughs> what was the six? I don't know. It wasn't. Uh, was no, he tuned. tried to use them. Um, I tuned stop. out. Yeah. <laughs> he tuned out. I tuned out. I was yeah, throw right. that one in there. I'm out of gas, all right? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That was decent. Rick does win, though. All right. <laughs> Let's put a break in. All right. <laughs> Take a break. <laughs> <You're just> like, <laughs> oh, to uh, honk in. Yeah, right. yeah. That was good, too. All right, Mac. Is there anything else? Uh yeah no so um uh yeah I was gonna ask like if you ever wanted to try any other motorsports or um, are you kind of like you know um the other categories don't match up to um what you race in um I've tried time attack I think drifting's my thing mm. <laughs> I do like driving on the freeway fucking around but other than that I think my thing is drifting for sure. Yeah. Nice, nice. <laughs> uh, um, there you go, Mac. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, no, um, the, 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 any of them, Sweet uh, questions, uh, Mac. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Hey, hey, first time calling in this year. It's uh, it's been. A while. I know it has um, been a while, man. Thanks for calling, though, yeah. man. Yeah, uh, for sure. Yeah, great. Um, okay. uh, yeah, no. Um, no so the uh, last thing I was. Gonna did say I was, not um, go into detail? Should I go into detail? I don't no. Know. Oh, no, no, you can. You can if you want. But um, no, like the last thing I was going to say was um, you. So you're trying to get into esports, like um driving esports uh no actually i'm just sim racing for fun i i don't know if there's a whole esports like community with i know there is for sim racers but i don't i don't know if that's what i'm trying to fully like go into if you know mm. what i mean so yeah like sim racing why i, why I got that set up is because i'm trying to give myself more seat time without crashing mm. and stuff and um, work on my handwork and stuff like that as practice versus like going into it. I didn't get it to get into like esports. Mm. Does, does it? Sure. Does a simulator really translate to oh, yes. the real car? Oh yes, yeah, yeah. really. Yes. Wow. It's, like I know there's a video on like a sim racer, like one of the best ones. He's never driven a drift car before, but all he does is drift on e simulators. Yeah. Something just made it. Yeah, yeah, Anyways, it's fine. And then um, yeah, yeah, check. He drove. He went all the way. He got invited to somewhere and drove someone's like drift car for the first time and he killed it wow Damn. it's insane he That's... never went on the track oh. before yeah all right well yeah, mac yeah. That's legit. thanks check, for calling check. brother right, thanks, appreciate bye. it let's uh bye. keep bye. it moving bye. we got ash ash catch, ash catch these hands <laughs> all right let's yeah, go yeah, yeah. what's up you're on there ash catch alex i'm good all right ash catch these hands catch this call bro all right let's move on Let's talk to Shiro. Shiro. Uh, well, this is my first time on the show. Yeah. Go ahead. Talk to me. What's up, uh, brother? I just want to kind of express the thanks about like talking about car community. I come from a very small island. I just moved out here to California. Yeah. Awesome. Ooh, which island? I come from uh, Guam. Oh. Nice. Interesting. I met a lot of Guam people recently in uh, Osaka. I mean Tokyo. Yeah, and like hearing about like car culture in Hawaii, it made mm -hmm. me remind. It made me miss home. Oh. And it's very funny that like a uh, car community in Guam is very backwards from the states. So mm -hmm. everyone's like uh, into trucks. Like mm -hmm. wow. Like uh, right before I left, I actually moved out in August. And I went to the local drag strip, and there was a Nissan hard body that went 10 seconds on the quarter mile. Oh, yeah, for sure. It seems like an island thing. I mean, Hawaii, too, there's a huge truck scene. <laughs> Me and Dumb are like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 I, the Guam. Wow. I just imagine your... monster trucks. I don't know what, what kind of trucks these are. But trucks. I'm, um, like, we're talking about, like, Tacoma. With the pickup truck. Tacoma. A pickup oh, truck. Yeah. <laughs> monster yeah. trucks is I the first thing you like, imagine when you hear trucks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mo monster truck. How about a Jeep? Are you trying to get into the truck scene in Cali? Uh, it's not my thing. My brother and my family are into off roading, mm -hmm. <laughs> and I've had my fair share in sim racing, so I'm used to circuit and time attack. Mm -hmm. It is amazing. There is a car scene for every type of car, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, completely. And it gets like there's different like groups too. Yeah, yeah. Stuff. It's 
That's a Facebook group for everything. Mm -hmm. Wow. Is there a car group for Aztecs too? Aztecs? What's, What's Aztecs? That? What's the car? What's what? What car is Pontiac? Aztec? What kind of car is Aztec? Is that like an old truck? Uh, Alex, hello. Can we look up Aztec? <laughs> Come on, research man. <laughs> I'm not too sure, but there probably is. Yeah, it's a truck. <laughs> What is that? It's one of the ugliest cars. That yeah, exists. the Mitsubishi joint. It's a oh, Mitsubishi the Pontiac. Aztec. Yeah, like, Pontiac yeah, yeah. Aztec. Wow. Pontiac. Yeah, no. Pontiac Aztec. There probably is. is there probably is. I'm, there is for everything. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's just probably really. Oh, you small. know what? Other fucking rally cars are crazy. You ever yeah. see rally racing? Yeah, rally yep. racing is insane. So yeah. they're going like at full mm -hmm. speed, and there's a guy next to him just saying these coordinates or like these mm -hmm. things. What if that guy fucks up and he's like, go left, I, but it's supposed to go right? Rally's yeah. so with, hot. Uh, rally races firsthand, and they're terrifying to watch. Mm Hundred -hmm. percent. First of all, photographers don't be right there next to the track. What the fuck are you doing? You know what I mean? It's just I think it's nuts. So cra I think they have the biggest balls. What? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, rally, rally racing balls. is off the public rally. Road. Yeah, some BDE. That's yeah. a yeah for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Big dripped huh. energy. Mm -hmm. Big dripped <laughs> energy. <laughs> <laughs> well, Shido, thank you so much for calling right. in, brother. Let's talk. Wait, to did he have a question? Or was no. that just a chat? I see, I see. Oh, yeah, if you yeah. have a question. Uh, I guess my only question is, for someone who is coming from a different practice of racing, what's the best way to get into drifting? Oh, get a drift car. <laughs> 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 I mean, yeah, yeah. get, get a, a real-wheel drive car and then switch, you know, get an angle Hydro kit for it. And you then can. basic shit. Start off basic because if you go extra, it's just more cheating. And then you kind of need mm. to do um, you you need to learn the basics first instead of going full on. Like I made the mistake of hopping into my FD that has wives fab, and then I went into my IS. Oh yeah, and I was like, ah oh, fuck. I was like, oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. It's, mm. I, wives fab is so cheat. So just start off more stock than you could ever, and then just go from there. One by one okay. with modifications, and then go to Apple Valley Speedway or um, Willow Springs. They have big skid pads, so you can fuck around there without hitting any yeah. walls. Damn, yep. that's some that's some good t advice right there. Hell yeah, because yeah. like my personal time attack car back home is a 2003 BMW M3. Oh, and wow, that was my dream so car like, back in the day. So like, I don't want to try sliding that, and then cry for six months right, over right. <laughs> yeah if you can't afford the damages don't get it that's the tip for yeah man sure. practice makes perfect yeah yep. and drifting is <laughs> so <the> expensive <laughs> <laughs> drifting's so expensive it's crazy yeah. you have to like get new tires all the time all the time you too. have to bring like pairs oh. yeah time. but you strip them so oh, yeah, yeah. I bet. Mm -hmm. on a normal uh session for me i bring about four pairs wow yeah. four i'm Jesus. like five usually all right, let's talk to Mexican <laughs> Hanu. Thanks for calling, bro. <laughs> Mexican Whoa. Hanu, what's up? Hi. How are you doing, bro? Whoa, hey, goddamn. how you guys doing? What's up, brother? Whoa, we got Whoa. Barry White over here. Yeah. It's always surprising <laughs> with his voice. It's like meditation voice. Yeah. You know, I have that app. It sounds like that. Right? Headspace or yeah, something? Yeah, headspace. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like one of those dudes. Yeah. <laughs> um, cool. just have a question for you. Yeah, what's go ahead. up? Uh, so <laughs> what's your stance on? Um, Sorry. The whole debate about dual clutch transmission versus um, just regular. Sorry, uh, repeat shift that. Chronic. What? Uh, what's the what? What's your whole stance on like dual clutch transmission versus manual? Oh, dual I don't know. That's a good question. I don't know that much intricate stuff good. on transmission. Are you talking about? No, no, we're not getting into. Wait, wait, hold on, <laughs> yeah. hold on. You're saying that now there's two clutches in cars. Yeah. Well, there's like automatic, there's manual, there's paddle shifting. Oh, like yeah. tectonics. Yeah. Is that what you're, I mean, not tectonics. This I know you're talking about. My... No, that is te tectonics. Yeah. And then it's more yeah. accurate usually on paddle, but then you can beg to differ with, it's very debatable on a mm -hmm. lot of things. True. So there's True. even sequential, which is super expensive. You know, the ones where um you just up, yeah, down, yeah, up, yeah. down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know how to drive yeah. a stick? Stick. Oh, come on. Do you I know how to drive a stick. stick? Yeah, it's crazy. It's Stephanie okay if you don't, stick. though. Oh, I do. I do. <laughs> I hate when, like, guys, when they're like, I don't know. I'm like, oh, then, I feel always happens. so bad when they're like, I don't know how to drive stick. I'm yeah. like, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, for no, sure. no, no, no. Trust <laughs> I me. Only... I pride myself in automatic. 
I could only <laughs> do it in like the FJ60, one specific car, because that's the only one that I like practiced in. So I want a sim. I remember when I met S- Steffi, she was driving a Porsche 911 and Ooh. going crazy with the. Was, was she grinding? I, was she grinding it, it though? Pro- Did you? Yeah, the probably my favorite <laughs> like experiences in my life was having that car and like just on the freeway at nighttime just driving really fast and yeah. having really amazing music on and crying or no <laughs> both yes crying wow. but also just feeling like like powerful yeah. and sexy and just it was just a hot you know yeah it was just I, I i can't say like there's any other experience that i could compare that to that just feels like amazing um, there's a lot of control i think with driving yep i suck at automatic <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Suck at automatic. I suck at driving automatic. <laughs> it's because uh, manual, I have more control over the car on every gear every aspect. Versus right. automatic, I have such a heavy foot. So I'm like, uh, mm. and then I brake like shit. And then I always forget that you have to put it in parking to turn off the car. Oh, but, no, yeah. but that's the side, like versus it's just one gear in automatic yeah. and I, I feel less in control. We there is control something freak. fun about that though, because I think also like if you are going off roading and things like that and in, in a Mm -hmm. there's something like it feels like you're part of the journey exactly and that it's you're with the car yeah and it it feels like more fun Mm -hmm. and you have something to play with you know like when you have the shift i always like kind of like shake it like this yeah the most anxiety i've ever felt ever in life is when you're driving a stick shift on a hill Mm. and you have to do that thing where you're gonna you're yeah. gonna fall backwards. You know what I'm talking mm-hmm. about. You yeah. roll back. Oh you have to balance man, the yeah. My I'm ass, more my of a up. I'm more of a Jesus take the wheel kind of guy. <laughs> you know I can see I mean? you on one of those like Harley bikes. Like that's your vibe. Easy. Oh, I, I like I, I like classic cars. Yeah, that's yeah. kind of more my vibe. You've always I, wanted mm-hmm. one of those like birds. Mm-hmm. What is it? What is it called? I'm no, more of a yeah. Yeah. I'm more of a lean back. Yeah. A I can see you with like your RBF and a cigarette and just pulling up. Okay, first of all, when we before you started, you're talking about how have an rbf yeah, which is resting bitch resting face, bitch face. Uh-huh. and that's not a pleasant thing to hear as yeah. a man did you especially. know that you had one i know i am I, I i do rest all the time like my demeanor <laughs> i'm a big rester uh, being it sounds worse because you're saying also... it like full on the yeah 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 say yeah. the acronym RBF. then it's like okay i get it, it sounds insulting yeah but an rbf just means like intimidating face or like you're always yeah rbf sounds like the drift car i would have <laughs> what do you drive in rbf <laughs> <laughs> That's like the, my she way. Said close, you look, close. She's saying you look like a bitch. No, yeah. no, no. But, wow. but Rick, no, but without talking, right? Yeah. Like even Rick, without talking, he could. Yeah. He could, He has an RBF. I, gotta, I have an RBF. She he could also have. Okay. One. He has like a more like intimidating mm. like mm. like body. Yeah. You know what it is? It's different. Like bouncer like, vibes. It, nah, it's because I fucking no. fell. No, no uh, one's no, looking at that. No one is looking. Is that a Harry Potter thing? What are you talking about? It's the eyes. Like sometimes we went to like a party this weekend, and you were just like standing like near the you just look like a bouncer out of nowhere <laughs> what? you were does. just like in your head <laughs> yeah. your head is always up right right and so right. like i'm just already like oh he's some he's doing something important and then your hands for some reason are like this <laughs> no wherever like, this wherever is, we go this is yeah. it he's he looks like he's working no yeah. seriously, like he, he looks like he's working the event i'm like are you catering here <laughs> like we came to eat i do like, feel right. safe I feel safe Do you? being around. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah but like- then when I see Dumb out, I'm like, oh, I want to. I haven't seen Dumb for a while. I want to talk to him. But then he's like so detached there. I am a little cold. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know and what I'm it like, is. Mm-hmm. I'm not an extroverted as people think I am, you know, because when they see the pod, they, no, they see I'm sure. very talkative. But at events, people do take me as a little bit a cold. But I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's my thing, you know what I mean? It's RBF thing. Do you get introverted sure. a little when you're out? Uh, yeah, I'm not. Yeah. I, oh, yeah. You know what? I don't like when people try to introduce me to people. Yeah. When they come, it's like, oh, you uh, should meet this guy. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Hey. Small talk. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah. Like Dumb, small you don't remember talk. me? KSA from 2007? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and he's really, you're really good at like keeping the conversation short and just oh, bounce, yeah. somehow bouncing, oh, but not, sure. not coming off rude or anything. I am the you're master the of like, let's keep it pushing. It's so mm-hmm. good. I give them uh, actually even a nudge. Like, yeah. like, I give them, I, I grab their back and <laughs> just know. give them a push. Like, right. uh, this yeah, conversational yeah, 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 build is crazy. Like, I'm sure. like, let's build and I push them yeah. forward. <laughs> but when he's drunk, he's really smiley, I think. I know, but I've been sober for two and a half months. Congrats. 
Congrats yeah. on you too. You, you stopped drinking? Yeah. Damn. I don't drink. I don't do anything about it anymore. I've been healthy as fuck. Wow. Good to know yes. you're not drunk driving anymore. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. She's sober. No, let me ask you. Let's play one last game before uh -huh. we call it a wrap. Ooh, a mm -hmm. game? Yeah. If there was uh, one car, it would, what do we oh, look no. like we would drive? Oh, oh that's a good one. Oh. Including Alex oh, over I there. Love. Yeah, yeah. I including would Alex. Start with Alex. That's start with Alex. Put you on the screen, Alex. Let's, let's see you. What's up, Alex? Wait, uh, can you look at your face? Yeah, put, put, put yourself here. <laughs> can you do that? All right. All right, here we go. Why, why you got <laughs> Stop throwing the peace sign up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> He's acting awkward. Look like I'm zooming with my fob cousin. Okay, well, I see him in like a Land Rover, Range Rover. Let's go. Like, oh. Who, Rick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Land Rover, Range I'm Rover. A like a new one? Like a modern big, one? Modern like, one. Okay, yeah. Modern one. I love the new one. Uh -huh, You're built I can like see a you in that, like, Shut the fuck black? up. Black? I can see a black. Yeah, yeah. black. Yeah. Gun I can metal. see black. I can see silver too. Yeah, uh -huh. silver's nice. Not white. Nah, not white. Nah. Not white. Kimchi stains all over that shit. Well, that yeah. looks like Rick. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> it I can looks see like him. Uh, <laughs> it just literally. His feet look just like that. White as shit. You know, very Go square ball. and boxy. That does. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Steffi, I could see her like, I mean, Porsches for sure, but even like a Mini Cooper or like a Volkswagen. Mm hmm. Like mm -hmm. kind of like a art okay. on the more Something like cute. unique. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put the car on the screen too, Alex. Will, yeah. yeah. Even a Fiat or what color? Uh, mm, maybe that lavender. <laughs> you look like you do. You have a, a Etsy account and you sell like lanyards. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I was like, wait a second. I want a sports. Car. What sports card would you give me? Sports car. Yeah. Uh, huh. You know what? I can see you in like a S chassis. Like, should I pull up like an S thirteen? Sylvia. Oh, what nice. Whoa. Yo, that, I can the, see her the headlights kind of look like your yeah, eyes. Yeah, I can see her in a I white one, it. too. Yeah, I can see her in a yeah, white yeah. one. This car's pretty sick. No, that car's sick. Cool. dope. No, I can see her in this can with I... her blonde. It's like, okay, so a lot of um, Japanese girls with blonde hair or like a stereotype <laughs> version, or like okay. ABG vibe, but you're not ABG, obviously, mm. Yeah. but you still have the style to kind of fit with this world. What it, how much is that? Can I get... I um, might... Really, a really clean one or a good one would be like even 20K, 25. Ooh, wow, okay. wow. Yeah, they're right. going... Even more. Okay. Even That's like, actually very good. Yeah, right? About, it matches her, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I about think Dumb Alex and Dumb are the hard ones right now. Yeah. We're wild cards. See, I feel wild like... Cars. He, I, I think it depends what phase in life you're in. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Um, quarter life crisis. Actually, <laughs> actually, I'm beyond quarter life yeah, crisis yeah. now. Like Tesla, I don't see you in a Tesla. Uh, obviously, I was talking about like... Oh, you I'm know, not a I'm Tesla really, guy. I just not. kind of got it because my car was getting really shitty and my manager's yeah. like, you should probably get a new car now. Yeah. Can't you see him in a classic Mustang? No. You know what I mean? <laughs> like those kind of black <laughs> ones. No. 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 Nah. No, like a bike guy or even <laughs> not a car, just like, like a bird like, scooter, <laughs> a motorless vehicle. <laughs> I think. Like a a a lime. He's like he's a lime or a bird kind of <laughs> guy. You know what? You're you're you look like a walker. You know. <laughs> 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 Did you just like say a, I look like I should be in no, orthopedic it, no, shoes? No, a metro. <laughs> low riders. Card, low, low riders. Low riders. Low riders. Low okay. riders. We I see that. Yeah. That's what I was, okay. He's like hopping down the street. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what no, I meant. Yeah, 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 I, I can see. That's, that's going to be that's my next shit. Like a you know why, though? Because you're RBF. RBF. Yeah. <laughs> it fits so well with these. That's true. With your it, hand out. Yeah. I know you quit smoking, but maybe like a level zero cigarette. Yeah, <laughs> and, like, and not only that, you know, when you take your pictures, you kind of lift your chin. You know, the, you I know, have the a cholo stance, kinda... right? Like yeah. a cholo stance. <laughs> Where yeah. is Even this full going? Right now, I can totally see you in one. This is yeah. This is kind of like an artisan. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know? like, like you did it, and then you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's, I can totally see Dom in that. Yeah, it's that true. LA vibe that you have. Yeah, yeah. that's true. I, I need I need your guys' help with Alex's though. I see him like in a right, hearse. Let's see Alex real quick. Let me see a hearse. <laughs> like a hearse. <laughs> like a hearse Yo, driver. No, I am dead. You know what I'm saying? Alex. Alex. He could be a limo. Like, I see I, him as, like, the chauffeur. I like, see him in the trunk of a car, actually. <laughs> I see him in a... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, uh, no, for real. Alex? Let me see Alex. Alex, come on. Let me see Oh, yeah, that's you. his car. <laughs> that, that is the car you have right now, right? Right, right. I can see him in, like, a forerunner. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, I see you. On it's because of his hair, a though. Truck. It's so long. Yeah, I can see him at the beach with a tank top, just like with flip flops, just dragging Striped his feet tank top. as yeah. he gets out. And How about like, a PT cruiser? Speaking pigeon and shit. <laughs> PT cruiser. How is oh God, it? That's, that's my worst. 
car. That, yeah. Like that's I don't know why that was cruiser? even invented. It's yeah. disgusting. It's disgusting. I think don't a lot trust of anyone who drives that. It's a PT a, Cruiser. It's like yeah. a Hearst. It looks kind of like one? a Hearst it slash. Some other. On. No, those shits were hot for a minute. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> no, people really fucked with these cars at yeah. one point. Nah, Do you remember Cash Money Birdman? He made a limo version of that. I remember. They're kind of funny. Yeah. Nah, he's he. I honestly, Alex looks like he could be from Hawaii. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh. Yes. yeah, his style and like kind of got a white eye guy, which is Can weird. Can you speak pigeon, <laughs> Alex? <laughs> it's uh, yeah. actually official Hawaii language. Yeah. First of all, how did it become? Because it sounds like weird English, right? Like yeah. So it's basically if we go historical times, um, when the Asians shipped over, I mean, <laughs> came over <laughs> to Hawaii, we had a um sugar factory right yeah. and so everyone was working there from like hawaiians to japanese koreans everyone oh. right so they all had to communicate with each other and it became broken mm. english aka That's called sick. pigeon i see so it's actually more chinese hawaiian influenced okay i'm really surprised oh, Brian, alex like didn't know that piece of history <laughs> mr alex's yeah. ancient, ancient asian almanac <laughs> He knows mad Asian facts. Really? Yeah. Apparently not the island kind. Okay. Yeah. So I to, it was really hard for me to like, I, I got really better at LA English. And sometimes people think I'm fob. Yeah. Which is my It's, it's the not, pigeon my coming out? No, because my THs are like Ds. Yeah. Like uh, I don't say the, I say duh. Yeah. Or like... She has no. a Korean cadence. But it's not. It's That's local Hawaiian. That's what I Hawaiian. thought it was, but it is Hawaiian. It's I think. super. Yeah. I have... Yeah. Yeah, I used to talk very pigeon, <laughs> and now I don't bring it out. Oh, wow. Come on. Be proud. Alex, what does broke the mouth mean? <laughs> it's, like, really good. So, like, back in high school, right, Delicious. there's so much fights. And then, you know, to fight, it's, like, bang, right? You want to yeah, bang? Yeah. And then to lick someone just means to fuck them up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, in high school, I'd grow up hearing, like, sup, you fuck up. Like, like, bang, <laughs> I'm going to lick you. Yeah, whoa. <laughs> Which means... You want to fight? Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna fuck, fuck you up. up. Right. But it sounds, sounds sexual. Like, a... <laughs> like they're gonna like. <laughs> yeah. It sounds cute. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna lick you. Yeah. Well, we are happy to have you here today, Sarah Choi, and yes. I'm, I'm happy to see you living out your passion Thanks in your profession me. as well. You yeah. know, doing ca- like cool showing up shit, to car yeah. events and for getting sure. to drive to cars, interview drivers. I'm, I'm assuming that's your dream job. Um, I'm actually transitioning into competing and acting. Wow. Oh, so I shot a short. I'm doing a soft debut with Hell a super yeah. short indie film. Sick. By the um team from Park Jun Pick. I forget. The Sundance. That's huge. I Which forget. one? I don't know, but I'm going into that with a little bit of stunt driving and that That's side. Cool. So hopefully, because I'm not trying to be fucking around too long. No, well, I awesome. hope to see you in Fast and Furious 12. <laughs> yeah, no, we'll see. We'll yeah. see. Dude, that'd be cool. No, Doing crazy. donuts on the moon. Represent. We'll I hope to see you accelerate in all your endeavors. You know what I mean? <laughs> And, uh, I hate you! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's good to see women with I couldn't get one pun in today, but Rick <laughs> had 12. Thank Ready you for the go. subs. Look R- at all R- those R- That is, by the way, 100% a car guy. Yeah, wow. yeah. It has RW... Wow, Rick you was are ready with the punch. <laughs> Look how many subs. Oh, shit. Wow. 100 gifted? Whoa. Oh, wait, wait, who's the so sub? Much. We should thank him. RW, what is it? He's RWB R-W- Black yeah, Bird. Yeah. Thank you. Um, thank you. And thank you, Sarah. Wow. Wow. This was RWB, so I get like 5% cut, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get lunch. <laughs> this was the I'm most kidding. car themed episode we've ever had. Yeah. Rick I love had it. 20 puns. He's driving me crazy. You're on it. That didn't even hit. Jesus Christ. All right. Right. Wait, you were making a pun just now? I said driving me crazy. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why that did. Maybe that one was a little too on the nose, huh? <laughs> That's fucking... What? Let's end it. That Let's was a it. pun. You, you were doing end. great, yes. Oh, God. Oh. It was cute. It's really cute. All right, I'll try. All right, next cool. time. All right. Well, uh, Sarah Choi, you can look her up on all the socials. Anything you want to plug? You're good? No. At Sarah.Choi. At Sarah.Choi. <laughs> yes. Thank you, Rick, Steffi, Alex. And tune in next week for another episode of Fun With Dumb. Peace. Bye, guys.